Hello everyone, welcome back to American. Today guys, we'll be using a modded truck today. This is a Freightliner Century. It also can be a Freightliner Columbus. The modder has made it where you can do either one. We're using Shorty's new, uh, or Smarty's new, um, wood shaving trailer. It can be found over on the workshop. Good looking trailer and truck. We're in, um, Burns, Oregon. No, we're in, uh, Medford, Oregon. We're going down to Burns, Oregon. Here's the interior of the truck. Got our passenger. So let's get on the road. Now the truck's running a cat engine, a 600 horsepower cat. Uh, quite a few options for this truck. Like I said, it can be doubled as um, a uh, Columbus or the Century. So we're gonna get on the road. We got 305 miles. So we, I have reinstalled the uh, truck stop mod. You can see here from all the trucks in the area. One thing happens with the truck stop mod. And also I have a mod in now that gives you uh, realistic names on, on your airplanes. So if anyone would like to see the Columbus version of this truck, you know, let me know because um, we'll run it. It's pretty much the same one, it just uh, changes the front end to a Columbus. Uh, once again, if anyone has been watching the videos, I want to say thank you for who's watching the videos. Um, no LSPD apart at this time. I've been having some issues with it. I'm trying to fix it. Um, always looking for new stuff to bring over to the channel. Uh, mostly what I what I use is off Steam, and Steam hasn't really released anything over there that. I think they would be good over here on our, on our channel. Go straight on. So I haven't drove this truck yet. We're gonna see how it does today. I wanted to do it on on a video with you. We got 305 miles to test it out. I, uh, well, I, a correction, I did drive it over there and pick up that load, and that was it. So everyone's doing well, hope everyone is doing well. Uh, just a reminder that we do have a America Truck Similar Facebook group, which is doing very well right now, and if anyone's watching, to watch the videos, I want to say thank you for joining the group. The, the group is doing very well. Uh, and also remember, with everything that's going on now, uh, to, to please stay at home. Um, one thing I can't tell you guys about this truck, uh, it doesn't have an air horn. Which is kind of weird, but you know, that happens sometimes. Wanted to run a modded truck for a change. Wanted to run something different from what we always run. You know. So I seen this one on the mod site, and I said, well, I'll give it a try.
Now there's been a few of these mods I have did in the past, um, this one is probably the best, cleanest one I've seen for the inside of the truck and stuff like that. And we'll get a thumbnail on down the road. Let me uh close that up. Yeah. Don't need that up right now. Um, the best place guys to use this trailer, if you want to use this trailer, you need to keep, kind of keep it up around Oregon and uh, Washington, you know, these are the big wooded states like this for forestry. Um, you're going to have a lot, you know, a lot better chance of finding uh, loads for it. Which, you know, it does make sense, you know. And I do apologize for the last live stream we had. We had so many issues on that live stream, but I think we got everything fixed now. Um, if there is a garage in the area when we drop this load, I will take go into the garage and show you exactly how would you change the hood on these trucks. So pretty much that's all you do is to change over to a Columbus and you would change the hood. There's no other extra uh, things that you get with a different model. It's, it's all the same. Outside view. Um, nothing new really from SCS. As, as you know, everything's going on. They're they're um, being affected by it just like everybody else is. So that's okay. You know, very understandable from, from, from my point understand what they're going through, you know. Get ready to turn left. Turn left, and then turn right. Turn right. See how she climbs a hill. Not bad. I'm going to go ahead and get a thumbnail, guys.
of this lane. I think that'll look good. Get ready to turn right. I am going to run a couple loads of this truck, see uh, how, you know, turn what I think right. about it. Now I got this mod off of mod sites, uh, ATS mod sites. Uh, it may be on other sites, I, I don't know, I haven't seen it on anything else. But the only ones that I really use is ATS mod sites and I use, um, Turn left. ATS LT, mostly. But not, not, not a bad mod. And as you know, I don't use too many modded trucks, so I wanted to change it up today. Don't you hate that? You get right to the red light and they change the green. Yeah guys, this is something you see with the uh, truck stop mod. You'll see trucks like this sitting on the side of the roads and uh, it's, been, it's been worked on from when it first came out. I used it for a while and I was having issues of um, when you go to get fuel, you couldn't get fuel because it was blocking the truck stops. All the spots. But I haven't seen that yet. Um, you know. This is a pretty little drive on this back road. Ooh, be careful here. We don't want to turn the truck over. It's Oregon State Patrol. This truck don't drive bad. It drives pretty good. Go 
straight on. Hope everyone's staying safe, you know, I hope everyone is, uh, kind of, I don't know what states everyone's in. Uh, I'm not here, I'm currently here in Georgia, um, the state's pretty much has been locked down, you know, you can only go for, get out for essential reasons. You know, other than that, they don't want you on the roads and stuff like that. get dark. <laughs> Let me pop up the menu here and see how many miles we got left. Oh, I hit the wrong button. 170. You know, for a cat engine. I've been checking out some other games too, guys, but I don't have no way to record them. Unfortunately, my, um, I use, um, Shadowplay, and some of the other games that I've been looking at is not supported by Shadowplay. So I don't have no way to record it. I am looking to trying to get some other kind of software for that. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. You know, I don't think I've ever been to this area. I don't remember ever going there. I may have been there, and I just don't remember it, but... Get ready to turn left. It doesn't look familiar. Turn left. Try and do more inside uh, action today. More inside driving, you know.
I done it again. Got 132 miles to go. I keep hitting the wrong button on that. I do apologize for hitting the wrong button there twice. I'm like, hey, a flashy light switch. Hey, turn your lights down. You got your lights on bright. It's always good to get on the back roads in this game. A lot of times they want you to stay on the interstates. So when you get these back road runs like it, it's fun, you know. So we're going to slow down a little bit. So guys, what do y'all think about the truck so far? I think it's pretty cool. Uh, pretty pretty nice mod. There's been other mods of the Sentry out there, and uh, I, I don't know. I can't remember the name the modder the name of the modder that for this mod. It could be the same one that I've used in the past. But it's a uh, pretty neat, pretty nice truck. There's your jig brake sound for the truck. Not the best, but you know. Get ready to turn right.
turn right. Yeah, so that's something that you see with the truck stop mod that we're using, like, right, right there. The fill lots and stuff like that, it, it brings the game more alive when you see that. Because that's what you would see in real life. And a lot of them, uh, some of them are empty, you know, but a lot of them are full like that. Yeah, you know, it always just depends on the air that you're in. We got 37 miles. We'll go ahead and leave that up. Like this truck is getting over. Go straight on. There's another truck stop out here. You see all the trucks at the pumps and stuff? Very nice mine. I don't know if there is a um, a rise down here. We'll have to see. We need to get over in this way. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. straight on.
turn left. Right here. It's from outside view. Well, they want it. Okay. Um. This is going to be the fun part. We don't want to hit that bomb, huh? Oh.
There we go. All right, we drove excellent. We drove 306 miles. It took us eight hours and 17 minutes to get here. We consumed uh, 72.7 gallons of fuel. We're gonna see if there's any loads out of here. Probably. No, there's not. Okay, there's some up in Burns. And whatever it's called. Well guys, that's going to be it for the video. I want to get in here and show off this trailer and this truck. Uh, there, unfortunately, there's no loads in this area for the, uh, like this. Sometimes you get this with these modded trailers. And even, you know, the SS trucks and trailers. Um, well, I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to have to travel 150 miles to pick up this load. Uh, so thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Have a good day.